welcome to the album review. Yeah. This is Suicide Silence is the Cleansing. Jake, what? I need your fucking info, your guiding words of light since you picked this up. I have none, this. so... I didn't really do any of this. So oh, we're just going off. Alright, we're just going right into it. No, yeah. we're kind of just going off of You're what fucking Google slut. Says. When did the album come out? I think 08. 2008? Yeah, 2008. Uh, what, what album is so this? this is, they're, oh, there's Case Candy. Yeah. yeah. I was gonna say, which, uh, Here, which one is this album? They're is this American the 5th album, 6th album, 8th album, 10th album, 100th album? Jake, you fucking... Do you I, I have you this one. You okay. okay, so, uh... So, they're a deathcore band. That is one thing. Riverside, California. Band was, there started in 2002. Oh, shit, there's multiple discs. Yeah, I think the second disc is demos. I didn't listen yeah. to it though. So for this one, this is has their original singer. He it was Mitch. I forget his last name. Mitch Lucker. Yeah. Before he died. Yeah, and they died. Rest the new guys. The new guy they got for him is pretty good. But. Fun fact: Um, Brandy Bly of Lamb of God fame did a show with these guys. They were, Lamb of God was on tour with Suicide Silence. I wanted to go, but someone had to have a fucking birthday party that day. And. Oh, well. That show, Randy sang um, YOLO, the the fucking You Only Live One song. Yeah. And it was fucking insane. The crowd loved it. Wow. It was great. One thing I do want to say about the album itself before we jump into it. I mean, it's not about the album, but it's something with the case itself. Is I was looking through it when I got yeah. the album. And uh, I looked on the back of like the little... The little the booklet, oh, yeah. and it said the website. This really shows how old this album is, because their website it says their official website is www.myspace.com yeah, slash is... suicide silence. <laughs> That's what era this, this album's fucking from. Fucking MySpace. Yep. I mean, this came out in 2008. <laughs> Wait, wasn't so. that just when like Facebook was getting popular? Yeah, but MySpace Facebook, was MySpace was oh, the king. This is their, their, first, the this their first album, I think. Oh, this is their debut. But they came out in 2002. Well, sometimes bands take a while yeah. to... Yeah, oh. look on Spotify. That was, like, that was like Korn, because I know Korn came out in 94, and they weren't really found until like the late 90s, because people were like not used to that sound. Yeah, this is their first album. Okay, this is their debut. So let's just jump right into it. The intro track is Revelations. It's okay. I... It wasn't really a track. It's not really a track. It's not really a track. Oh, wait a minute. Was that the one where you said it was the, the phone dial? No, no that's the later. Dial that's, tone? No, that's the later. Green Monster. Oh. I thought that was the one so with this the dial one, tone. This one literally, it's just a little bit of like noise and sound. It's really just and noise. And it just goes it's, it's right into Unanswered. I did this not, is one of my favorite songs on this, Unanswered. I was not a fan of this track. I won't lie. Really? No. Um, it, was, it was fucking... <laughs> I, yeah. Damn. Um, I love it. I mean, it was an explosive. When I listen to watch. albums, um, the way I usually do it is I'll have my headphones on. I'll put on a game, but I'll turn off all the volume on it. And then what I'll do is on my phone, I'll have the lyrics up. And thank God I had the fucking lyrics up. Oh yeah, because I I can't I cannot it. understand a single word that he said this entire album. Like, yeah, yes, definitely. unless I was looking at the lyric sheet as he was going on, I literally could not understand. Yeah. So this one is pretty much about your. Praying to God and he's just not answering. Yeah, okay. So what I, that song's about. I don't. Okay. So there's a religious context. Yeah, there's so a religious a, subcontext. A, to this yeah, song. to this song. Yeah, because it's song. like it's saying about all like you can say all these prayers and nothing happens. Mm. Why is that? Uh, they're probably gonna come up with the uh, the heretical excuse of God isn't real. Fucking God's dead. Some oh yeah, yeah that shit. comes on. Next one's lot. Hands of a Killer. This one's all right. I, like I didn't this mind one. this one. I this one is okay. okay. Yeah, um, I like this album. Um, not all the songs, but instrumentally, this album. Yeah, is it's great. Great. There's a lot. Of, the, I the, love this types of music because it's more the, instrumental. Mm, the fucking aggressiveness of the 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 guitars, the yeah. drums, the bass. It's all there. It's shit that I like too. Yeah. I like that that kind of yeah. like really fast. Yeah. Like yeah. That's... Shit that I'm trying to play and trying to learn. This is this kind of stuff. It is it in that to, range. It's in that range, but it's just like it's explosive and so to me, I I couldn't understand why I couldn't get into it as much. But, really? Yeah, dude. Like I, I, we'll get into that later. Before I fucking jump uh, jump uh, the gun, but continue. Yeah. So, this is just headbanging music, though, too. It's just really fast headbanging. For people who don't like metal, if you want to try and jam on something in the gym, listen to this shit. 
Ignore the words, but just listen to the fucking music. This cannibal corpse, anything heavy. Yeah. Yeah. And it'll just pump. You'll have the fucking creep. You won't. Hour passes, and you next thing you know, you you'll have roid rage. <laughs> you'll have, you'll be like, what the fuck? <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> Ten, did we do hands of killer? No, yeah, price of beauty. Killer. Price of beauty. Yeah. Price of beauty was one of my favorites. I don't really? like that song. You know, like, it was okay. I, I, I mean, like I'm in the same boat as AJ. It was okay. It was okay, but it was also one of my favorite tracks. Favorite, as in it was just alright. I was reading the lyric sheet on this one. The, it was rough. It's rough. It's man. rough. I just shit. don't like it. Mm. Next is the fallen. Yeah. Which the first? Okay, that was fine. These first couple. The songs, fallen is they all. Black. They all have a little bit of a similar sound though too. Yeah, they're all. That's similar. probably why I couldn't get into it at first because everything sounded blended. Everything like, like it, the first it, half sounds kind of blended, same-y. and then the after yeah. the second half it starts branching out to like different solos, different, yeah. different. Um, yeah. Like slow, like slows down a little and picks up more. <laughs> yeah. Um. No this is my favorite song. No pity no for, for a coward. coward. This is probably my favorite. That too. was the single off the album. Wasn't it, it was the hit single. Uh, yes, I think. <laughs> so this one. Yeah. This one's. I'd like this one. And this one's about suicide. If you try and kill yourself, it's saying don't do it. You're be a coward until the very end of the song where it's like, do it, pussy. What, what are you doing? Just do it. If you're okay. went this you far, just do it. Do it. Do a flip. Like the line, the main line at the end of the song, they do it like three times, and it goes. Seconds from the end, what's it gonna be? Pull the trigger, bitch. Oh, damn. Yeah. It's just... Does anyone want a cheese No. <laughs> there you go. So the next track's The Disease. That this, one's... That one was... Eh. To me, it was yeah. okay. Well, I didn't following... Mind it. Go ahead. I didn't mind it. If It was more or less just one of those... To me, I think it was like a filler track. Yeah. Yeah. It, it did feel like that. Because right after their top song on this album that it's yeah. kind of just drops down. This is also them, it, it, since you said this is their first album, this is them probably trying to find their sound. Yes. Yeah, so I'll give them a little bit of like... There's, bit there's a lot of leeway when it comes to that because a lot of bands' first albums, they either smash hits or they're fucking like... Garbo. Yeah, Garbo or like meh. And yeah. then as like, then it's like their second album is like the biggest fucking one that people go to or like it'll progress until finally it's like, oh, this one's pretty well. Like they have a lot of, they got a couple albums. They're still dropping new music. I, they dropped a new one this year. They're a fairly new group, so. Yeah. For the, for the time, yes. Yeah, they, they dropped Compared a new to most shit we year, listen to. I, Actually, I yeah, relative to, to most stuff we listen to, this is, this is definitely one of the newer ones. Legend so. to Death. This one's okay. I didn't mind this. This one, one yeah, kind of changed fun. the sound a little bit. This is where you start getting yeah, this instead one's of like a little the real different. chuggy, real fish mm-hmm. chuggy. How the first songs were. This one starts going a little. Still has it, but goes a little away from it. Yeah. So like they put, I think, more of a a solo part into it. Right. Mm-hmm. Girl of Glass. That one was. That one was pretty good. That's like that. that's another track I thought was like not bad. Like I could dig it a bit. The lyrics for this one were pretty good. Yeah. This was one of the better ones again. In a photograph. Uh, I don't know why. I like when I seen this, this one. When I seen this, I thought <laughs> I thought it was gonna be like something like Nickelback. Look at this photograph. Oh, oh Christ! <laughs> that would be great. <laughs> mm. They do a cover of it. Yeah, yeah they do style. a cover of it. That'd be funny. Yeah. Eyes sewn shut is next. That one was fucking brutal. That one, yeah, that, that one, one was very, fucking very dun, 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 like that kind of shit. Yeah, That's this one's not awful. Into. I don't hate this track. I yeah, definitely could vibe with that one. It's decent. Uh, Green Monster. This is the one I was talking about. The one with the dial tone. With the dial tone, like it sounded like dial tone, but it wasn't. But like you just hear talking, and then in the background you hear. Ah, ah, oh, like ah, someone's getting like, fucking. Like butchered. someone's just getting tortured. Christ. Yeah. And For like the last minute, minute and a half, I think. Yeah, it's like and the last minute. Destruction so. of statue. This Th- one that is really actually like. the hidden track off this album. That's a hidden. Yeah, I mean it's written on the back, but it's like upside down and like not listed, so it's kind of like a hidden track. Oh, Spotify okay. has it on here. Yeah, yeah well, well they have to because it's yeah. the whole album. Yeah, yeah. They, 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 Which they that, that one, that that one is good. I love that one's all right. I love hidden tracks on songs. Yeah, they, I love. You know, I like the idea of a hidden track. Because this one, this one was also this one sounded, this one had a different style than the entire album. Yeah. This is Yeah, this one was the most different track. Yeah. Yeah. I appreciate it for what it is, but it's it's not one of my favorites. It was still like still had the chugginess, still had the quickness, but it was just 
like a different sound. Compared yeah. To. Yeah. Okay, so that is the cleansing by Suicide Silence. <laughs> Final thoughts, everybody. Oh, um, I like it. To me, it's brutal. This is something that I would have to listen. To, like I'd have to listen to it in full view, just so I can fucking jam on it a little bit more. Yeah, like I just, listen to it by yourself. It is kind of. It was kind of out there. It's just something you need. Need like a, like a group of just hardcore, brutal ass metalheads, yeah. and you just get in a car and just drive and just yeah. listen and jam. Yeah. That's just like a like a group listen to me. So I'm not a huge fan. I no. will, I'm not gonna. I, I didn't expect it. you guys to be huge fans of it. I, just I didn't. To... I don't hate it. It's definitely not terrible, but like. This just isn't my music. Like as of the current the recording yes. of this video, this is just not what I listen to. I can't appreciate it for what it is. I mean, there's tracks I don't mind. Like there's definitely tracks that are interesting. Like The Price of Beauty is, is not bad and No Pity for a Coward is honestly okay. And a few other tracks I do like on this album like a little bit. But I just this is not it for me. Right. I just can't. Oh. What about you, Zach? You agree? Um yeah, I mean, there's a couple of songs I like. Uh, I don't like any of like the the starting track. I I don't think the I think unanswered is okay. Um, Hands of a Killer was all right. Uh, Whoa! It doesn't want to stay. Up. I'm holding it now. I I just don't. I, I this is not for me. This, this I didn't is, think it was. This is not. I just did it for just because of. Cause you already know my Halloween one. Oh, we know you had to pick a spooky album. Yeah, yeah. You, gotta, you had to. So it was either. It. Is either gonna this be like something with Halloween or Nightmare Fuel? Bro, that's fucking like hostile. Yes. That, that's this like, is this is fuck. <laughs> that's oh, that's yeah. brutal. Well, I guess we'll jump into. Well, now you got a taste Jake. of what I listen to. Jake, what is your rating for this? Considering you picked it first, or you or since you picked, mm. it? I'm say like seven. Okay. Okay. That's not bad. Yeah. Not, I really um, like this album. Well, it's, do you want to go or do you want me to go? I'm gonna give it a three, bro. A three? Wow! Yeah. I didn't expect you to not like wow. it that much. I, I couldn't jam on it as much as I thought I would. I like Suicide Silence, but I didn't imagine it just being. If they they tried putting everything out there too. Yes. Fast. Uh, try. They're all. They just threw time. everything against the wall, and I feel wow. like it's like three. dumping a fucking paint can up in a wall and be like, "This is my modern art masterpiece," and someone pisses on it. Yeah, they're just, not not in that harsh of a yeah, context. They're pretty like, much well, like since it's their first album, I didn't know it was his first album. It's they're trying to figure out yeah, their main. Sound. Sound. So with that, I will give it a bit of leeway, but I personally, I think it's a swing and a miss. I, I I'm giving it, it, I'm giving it a four. It's, wow. It's oh, a, wow, you're higher than Luke. I thought I didn't know he was. Giving I thought it that, that was, yeah, I didn't know it was going to be that. Four is not a, it's not good. I know you'll it's, change it's below if you average listen to it me. together, where you have another metalhead to listen yeah. to. It. Like again, it's not terrible, but it's definitely a swing and a miss. Zach's gonna be a one. I I knew my score for this album. I before listened you listen to it. No, not before I listened to it. I always give every album a fair chance, and I always do it. This album is not for me. And no, I, didn't think I will say there are some tracks that I liked off of it, but as soon as I was in like this the fifth track while I was listening to it this morning, I, want just... I was like, I knew immediately what I was gonna score this album. I'm gonna give this like a two. Uh, wow. I do not like this album. It's not there it. was like it's just not like it. I said, there was two songs that I think are like passable. Yeah. And then other than that, I can't do it. Cause I, I like I said earlier, I didn't understand a single word they said. I if I didn't have the lyrics. Probably like this. <laughs> probably not. Uh, she wouldn't like it. I don't know. She might. She likes the screaming stuff. Yeah. But like, I don't know. So, but uh yeah. I guess you win then. Damn. Okay. I had yeah, a, I had a good one. He gave it two. I yeah. gave it a two. Wow. So we went I had seven so three. Four, three, two. Yep. Wow. Interesting one. Very should interesting. I use my silver bullet this week, or no, should I go on to something you're good? Talking bomb mm, you're talking what about? do you think? What, what, what do, do you, you want? think, Luke? Silver bullet or something good? What is something good? I don't uh, know. I would like to hear your something good. I don't. My like. something good. I mean, we we could vote on it if we really want. What you guys want? A silver bullet or something good? Well, what's the silver bullet? Because now I'm interested. My nuke. Ah, my nuke. You know what? Everyone's picked something that someone else has thought is shit. Should we give Zach his time? Yeah. To no, all right. Bad, you want to do the silver uh, bullet now? Yeah. Should we, should we? Uh, or should we wait? Uh, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna okay. Wait. All right. Why, wait. Why I'm, are you? Why are you giving us the option? Like, you should have just shot us right in the say, foot right away. No, I won't. I'll. I'll. Don't hurt us. 
I'll let you guys slide this week. So oh, we're going to listen to a good album this week. Thank God. Um, Jeez. This one's going to be a little harder. This one's not on Spotify. Okay. But oh. I was thinking about this one earlier. Wait, so I, I, how I, I just remembered it. it now. What is it? Um, we're going to be listening to The Chronic. Oh, The Chronic! The Chronic. Oh, El Chronico! That album's fantastic! <laughs> Wait, is that on Spotify? <laughs> no, no. It's, sadly it's not on Spotify. So yeah, I have to listen to it on YouTube or something. YouTube it. We'll figure it we out. We'll give you a CD. Yeah, I could, we could do that. 